welcome back to my channel it's your girl marlea j and i'm back with another video for you guys if you are new here don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe to your girl's channel go ahead and click that button right here right here i don't know what side it's on but click it get your girl to 300 subscribers i am almost there oh you guys today is gonna be a little 28 week pregnancy update it's been almost two months since i've updated you guys and i didn't even realize how fast like it does seem like it was not that long ago i did my 21 week update and then i went back on my video and i was like when did i post that and i looked and i'm like what the that's crazy y'all anyway so today i am 28 weeks and like four days and I don't know where to start. Where should I fill you guys in at? So for me, no, let's talk about baby. So baby's been good. He has been amazing. He has been excellent um, as far as his health and everything. I had my 28 week update. I mean, 28 week update, 28 week um, glucose test. I don't know if I mentioned this already. When I was 14 weeks, I had to do the glucose test because I had high risk factors because so many people in my family has diabetes. So they wanted me to take it early and then at 28 weeks to see if I developed it over time. So I had that the other day. I'm going to insert the clip. Um, the glucose test is not even all that bad. It just tastes like sugary but flat pop. Um, okay, guys, I just finished my drink. Yeah, this is my fourth time taking it. And you know. so many, the, the nurse was telling me, she's like, so many people throw up and have to come back. And I'm like really like it's not even that bad but i mean some people are probably sensitive but like you know it's not that bad to me but anyway so yeah everything looked good my midwife she gave me the okay to do the water birth which i'm so excited about my third baby if you don't know my first two i got the epidural at eight and she was like oh if you got the epidural at eight we're good she was like as soon as we get to eight when you want the epidural if, and you say you want the epidural we're just gonna get in the tub and we're gonna do it that way and you're gonna be good she was like that baby's gonna come flying out this is your third she was like it's not gonna be long labor i promise you i'm like bet my nigga you feel me like that gave me some reassurance gave me a blood pressure machine and a thermometer to take myself I'm like, at this point, like, what is y'all getting paid for? Because I'm doing your job. And before um, June, you guys, my last time I, with the corona going on, the last time I was physically seen was early February. Exactly. <laughs> so, it's been, a, it's been real different from my other pregnancies, but... You guys, I honestly like not having to always go in when they're doing the same routine shit. Because I wasn't high risk, I wasn't seen like that. I mean, I had phone appointments, but it's like, okay. Everything's starting to open back up um, and get back to normal. I'm happy because it's like just in time for, you know, me to give birth. But anyway, I can still only have one person, which is going to be RJ in the room, obviously. He cannot leave the room, so they're going to have to like order him food and stuff just like they would order me that i have gained the perfect amount of weight and she also measured my stomach because people be like and i'll be like bro y'all are really gassing it i'm finna show y'all my belly and y'all tell me what y'all think maybe it's because i'm a little person but people really be doing too much and i'm like here's my belly y'all rude <laughs> nah <laughs> but anyway yeah my midwife was telling me that like because this is my third kid i'm gonna stick out further pretty much because my oh, muscles so have nice. been stretched obviously three times Duh. but anyway <sighs> you guys i have <laughs> not gotten any stretch marks still Lord. and yeah the baby's been perfect he's been super healthy we listen to his heartbeat I was the only one, I, like, RJ still can't come to my appointments, which suck. Um, so, but it's cool. It's fine. Because they be doing just simple, boring stuff anyway. He probably would be, like, okay. They be doing the dad's dirty. They just be letting him sit in the corner quiet, you know. <laughs> Excuse me. I plan to um, record my birth, my um, birth 
like literally i can't fucking talk i plan to record a birth vlog let me know if you guys want to see that only if you guys want to see it i'm not going to record it if you guys don't want to see it give this video a thumbs up right now if you want me to record that um my only thing is if rj is like in the tub with me and stuff how else we gonna record nobody else can be in the room and we gotta i think we gotta sneak so then again i don't know we'll see i'm gonna try but it he has been kicking the heck out of me and his kicks hurt you guys like it don't make no sense i'm like how are you this little and your kicks are this strong already i'll just sit there all of a sudden i'll be like oh are you like what's wrong i'm like he just kicked the hell out of me <laughs> like that's really how they be like i don't remember them being this strong with um zayden and zaylani this little boy got some power to him you guys this has been a pretty smooth pregnancy though like i literally feel normal kind of but just like i'm carrying a life like obviously i have a life in my stomach i feel kicks but this has been like one of my smoothest pregnancies ever and i'm so thankful i'm so grateful because i could not imagine being to take care of two toddlers and then feeling horrible i haven't had morning sickness like all my pregnancy i probably felt morning sickness maybe twice and that was like my first trimester i haven't thrown up this is my third pregnancy i haven't thrown up it's crazy i know don't ask i have no idea oh, heartburn y'all <sighs> y'all i know you guys remember me telling you i had heartburn in my 21 week update now that was some little moderate to mild type stuff this has been severe to where i can't eat nothing spicy i get instant heartburn i cannot it, it really strikes at night like i gotta sit up i gotta like girl i'll be chewing on ice my throat be on fire like it, it like it really be horrible and i have been having braxton hicks especially when i'm super active like i was helping my mom move this last week and I started having a bunch of them. I had to like sit down, make sure I'm drinking a lot of water. I have not been sitting down this pregnancy. This baby been making me want to be organized. You guys, I organized my pantry all night. I've organized his nursery. I just want things to be clean and organized. Like, especially once he gets here, I'm deep cleaning this house again, like before he comes. I'm giving y'all Chun Li vibes. Chun Li. <laughs> had an ultrasound, a 4D ultrasound, um, because they had been there to tell me that the last time I was gonna see my baby was my 20 week anatomy scan. And sis, who do you think is gonna sit and wait until I birth my baby to see him? But are you dumb or are you stupid? <laughs> like, like, what'd be wrong with them? <laughs> it's something wrong with me. Which I scheduled, I paid for it. It was like $160. Videos, I have pictures. I'm gonna insert a picture of him, maybe a video if I can get it on there, but I'm gonna insert a picture. You guys, y'all not gonna believe who he looks like. Take a guess. So I showed everybody the picture of um, him. I literally, as soon as we got back, I sent it to everybody. My mom, RJ's mom, uh, my cousin, my sister. I'm like, who does he look like? Everyone said my oldest son, so yeah. And he does, you guys. It's so funny because, like, what if they really twins? And it's going to be so cute because I'm going to match them with everything. Like, like I have one boy, one girl. So I, I can only match them so much. You know what I'm saying? Them, I can. they can literally be, like, matching like twins. And I can't wait because it's going to be so cute. But, yeah, he looks like Zayden, you guys. So he's going to be so cute. And I know he's going to have so much hair. Who are friends with me on Facebook? I made a um, status saying like, give me a unique boy Z name. Um, and y'all actually commented some cute, unique stuff. I'll, um, I was kind of shocked. Y'all gave some pretty good um, names. So one of the names was actually his name. Literally one person, one person had it on there. Um, but it's, his name is spelled different. Y'all have so many good names, but his name reveal. I'm like, should I tell y'all his name or should I have y'all wait? Hmm. Hmm. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
yeah and that's it for this update make sure you, your notifications are turned on because we got a lot coming um up this month and the next month i mean our maternity shoots are booked for this month we're gonna do a belly cast so much fun stuff y'all so make sure your notifications are turned 